Okay, we're going to try testing that air conditioner, doing the bubble test again. I've been letting it run until it stops and then doing a bubble test. And I don't leave my stuff sitting over here because I don't want it to get... Uh, Not to vibrate off of here, fall, but um, that blade usually doesn't stop where I can see, so I got to get my little. Oh, good. Okay, so down there is where I'm looking. I'm gonna spray it. I used up my whole bottle of bubbles. I'm trying to get. around the middle of it where I was seeing bubbles before I'm trying to get it on the video I don't know if I can there we go maybe that'll be hard to tell now I don't think I'm seeing the bubbles like I did before Yeah, the last couple times, probably didn't have the camera on it because I couldn't figure out how to do it. I saw bubbles. Let me lay the camera down. Oh, cool. Maybe I'm not hitting it with the bubbly water. Kind of need everything to be in the same spot. There we go. Yeah. I don't know if you can see that or not, but I can. That's right in the middle of the screen there, but it's just bubbling away when you when you get that hit with that bug soapy water. I counted them a while ago. I'm not gonna try to do it again. I'm just gonna watch it. Yeah, there may be a couple of them weak in there. And I can't really tell if it can be seen on the video, but I can see that the light is in the picture, so probably can be. Usually they do better than you can tell on this screen. Yep. It's a pretty good leak. So it was charged to day or two ago. So this can do, uh, I'll call it a coil because I can't even remember which one's a condenser and which one's a, I forgot the other one, the other one you call it, but evaporator and condenser. I always forget which one's which inside, outside. Always done that ever since the 70s. But, uh, yeah, kind of in the middle of the coil. Yeah, you go on down to the bottom, and I don't see any bubbles. So that's not, you know, sometimes the bubbles will fool you. They'll just bubble up just because they're bubbles. But, see, it's blowing bubbles. So, uh, I don't know if I'm really showing... Yeah, let's see. Oops. Not sure if my video is really showing it or not. There's one, one thing there. Let me move this over. It'll come on in a minute. Any minute, actually. There. Let me squirt it again one more time if I can. Oh, I just squirted my phone. I tried real hard not to do that. Never got it wet before. There we go, I see bubbles again. I think I've got the lens wet. I can't really wipe it right now. Yeah, I see the bubbles again. I don't know if I can see them on the phone or not. Yeah, where that pipe, it's right uh, below where that one turns off to the left. There's two of them. Yeah, now that should be in the, and it is bubbling. I won't know until I watch the video back whether it's going to show up on the video. I just washed my phone a little bit. A little bit too much, really, but it's not, it's still working. All the light moving around makes it makes it go nuts, doesn't it? Now I see bubbles still. All right, let's get off.
comes over there on the water hose thingy. This is pretty much empty now. My, this is was um, aloe vera, but I just got a nice. Uh, I washed it out and saved it the other day, having no idea what I was going to use it for. But it's got just the right thing. You know, a lot of times you you, you might think, well, like when you do tires, do this with tires, you might use a squirter, you know, a, a pump squirter, but for this, that wouldn't work because it'd be too far away to ever get it on the coils. But with, with that squirting a good heavy stream, it's, uh, I think my phone got wet. Never got it wet before. But it, it's going nuts. It's zooming in and out. Oh, I see the zoomer moving. It is. Maybe it's just doing that automatically. I don't know. I've never seen, really seen it do that before, though. Anyway, that worked really well. And it takes it five or at least five minutes, ten minutes for it to shut back down. Then about the same amount of time it comes back on. Um, it's 91 today. And uh, it was, when I was, before I started this, it was 72 and a half degrees in my room. I guess it must be set on 73. I didn't remember to look. Which I like. I, that's good for me. Because <clears throat> it usually gets really hot in my room. Uh, you, I haven't seen it that cool. Well, my server's not running in my room. That's why. Uh, I've got a server, my backup server running in the garage because I'm having trouble with the server making noise. And I'm in the middle of trying to straighten all that out. Well, I'm going to go. Now I know for sure I've got a leak, so. Alright.